Um, here I am again, Darajin. Um, very nice to um, film this uh, short uh, video again. Um, I have uh, posted uh, many uh, videos on my uh, channel. Most of the uh, videos I don't really talk about, you know, um, asking questions or how to answer the question, just a simple uh, lesson. And for you who are interested uh, to learn Khmer, they just uh, go and practice there. So today I want to do something different that I, I hope this will uh, help you to understand and answer the question. So my strategy is that I'm going to ask you questions and have you how to learn to answer those questions. So today um, we are going to practice with four questions and you try to answer those four questions and this will help you first your listening skill and second how to answer the question correctly okay so let's go to my to those four or uh, four questions okay Today, I'm going to talk about the YouTube channel that I am. So, the first question is What is your name? What is your name? In Khmer, we say Ne Chmu Ai. Ne Chmu Ai. Ne Chmu Ai. Give a second and learn how to answer these questions. Okay? Learn how to answer this question. So, ne chmo ai. You see, um, in written, uh, Khmer language uh, used like a full question structure, like ta ne chmo ai. But believe me, in spoken, in daily life, you know, um, situation, when we ask questions, we don't really put the ta in front of them, the question maker at the end, that's the structure. We just use, for example, the one that I just did, like, ne chmo ai. So the ai is like the question maker for what? Ne chmo ai. Okay, you got the answer yet? I hope you get it. So let's listen to my answer. So if you receive this kind of question, what is your name? Your response should be, knyom whatever name you are Knyom Chmu whatever name you are okay I hope you got this one okay let's go to the next questions how old are you this is a little strange questions as a westerners because you don't normally get asked this kind of questions in your country but believe me in Cambodia our culture, um, when we get to know each other well, this question you are expected to get asked by Cambodian people. Okay, so how old are you? In Khmer, we say, Ne are you Or Bong Bong are you Panmanchnam? Bong are you Panmanchnam? So, what is your response to that kind of? Uh, questions. What is your response? Hope you can get this one. So your response to this kind of question, you should start with I, right? Knyom, mien, ayu, whatever age or old you are. You just put, for example, knyom mien ayu sam sapchnam. Knyom mien ayu sam sapchnam. And sometimes in real life situation, the word chnam at the end of the sentence, chnam, it means year, okay? Sometimes chnam, you don't hear the chnam, they just answer knyom ayu sam sap. Because 30, it means 30 years old already, okay? So chnam at the end is optional, okay? I hope you get this one. Next questions. 
Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Uh, in Khmer, we say, Bong Maupina. Bong Maupina. Bong Maupina. It also means, where have you just coming from? So there are two answers for this one. The person could ask, like, what's, which country are you from originally? Or where have you just coming from? Mm -hmm. So, Nek Mao Pina. Nek Mao Pina or Bong Mao Pina. Mm -hmm. Bong Mao Pina. Bong Mao Pina. Mm -hmm. So, what is the answer? You can say, Knyom Mao Pi Amrit. Knyom Mao Pi Australia. Knyom Mao Pi Thai. You can answer the name of the country or the other way you can say Kyo Mo Pi Psa I just got from the market or I just coming from the market Kyo Mo Pi Psa so there are two answers okay with this uh, question Nek Mo Pi Na Ba Nek Mo Pi Na okay the last question uh, I hope you will enjoy this kind of um, lesson because this is help you to practice your listening skills and then your answer okay have you eaten yet? Have you eaten yet? In Khmer we say Bong nyam ai hai nai 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 So this question, um, it depends It can, if the question, this kind of question got asked in the morning They want to ask you, have you eaten breakfast yet? Uh -huh. Or you have, uh, have you eaten lunch yet? Or have you eaten dinner yet? Something like that. Okay. But it, like I just mentioned, it depends on the situation, real life situation. If I got asked this kind of question in the morning, I assume that they are asking, have I eaten breakfast yet? So, nyam ai hai nau. Nyam ai hai nau. If you have eaten already, you say, nyam hai. Nyam Hi, nyam mm hai. -hmm. What if you haven't eaten yet? So what is your what is your response for that? You say, at tuan nyam, or kyo at tuan nyam, or at tuan, at tuan nyam. Let me um, review the four questions again. So the first question is, what is your name? What is your name? In Khmer we say, bong chmu ai or nek chmu ai. Bong chmu ai, nek chmu ai. Second question, how old are you? Bong a yu pon man chnam. Bong a yu pon man chnam. The third question, where are you from? Bong mau pi na. Bong mau pi na. Bong mau pi na. The last question is, have you eaten yet? Bong nyam ai hai na. Bong nyam ai hai na. Bong nyam ai hai na. Okay, so thank you very much, guys. I, I hope you enjoyed this uh, short video. And if you have any other questions or ideas or things that you want me to clarify, I am more than happy, you know, to answer your question. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel so that you will receive any new video when I post uh, on our YouTube channel. Okay, and please, as I mentioned, if you have any question, please. Uh, put your comment in my uh, YouTube uh, channel and I will respond to your um, uh, questions. Okay, so thank you very much and have a good day. Bye.